Hey, welcome Broken World Entertainment. And Robin, with a Y, Hood, director, that's director X, melts down over series negative reception. Claims shows being review bombed by racists. And of course, he's done his little video and he shows all the thumbnails calling the show out before the show even came out. Included in that list was me, your very own Broken World Entertainment. Shout out to Robert Smith for pointing that out to me. I've made so many thumbnails, I forget which is mine. And sure enough, it's mine. But let's get into the first little part of this, which is the fact that he's claiming that people who are not in the US are review bombing this show without even seeing the show. Well, as you can see, we have a little video playing in the background here. That video I recorded. I recorded. It is, of course, the opening part of episode one of Robin with a Y Hood. I'm in Ireland and lo and behold, I can watch your stupid little show. By the way, I only lasted four minutes into this garbage before I was like, I'm done. Nope. He also told people to use VPNs. You know, the thing that if you're in another country, you can change the location and watch these types of shows. He told people. Someone asked, Thanks, does it have an American broadcaster yet? I'm in the middle of an international move. I think it might be the last thing I see on my TV. And his response, Director X, or Julian Christian Lutz, replied saying, Not yet. It's VPN time. <laughs> and then he reburked on that by saying, You've all arrived. I love how these folks see an obvious review bomb and say, VPN, you all really plain stupid. You told people to use a VPN. So if they used a VPN, watched their garbage show, how is that y'all being stupid? Ryan Kinnell of RKO Post, of course, called him out beautifully. He responded saying, you literally told people to use a VPN to watch it internationally a few days ago. LOL. Now you're acting like it's a weird thing to suggest. I know this is hard to imagine, but maybe people don't like the show. And that's exactly it. The show is garbage. <laughs> like pure garbage. But let's have a look at some of this. So, apparently unable to accept that his modern reimagining of the arrow slinging outlaw may only appeal to a very, very small niche of audience, Robin, with a Y, Hood, Julian Christian Lutz, has lashed out at critics of his new series, accusing them of being not just angry nerds, but also outright racists. Created by Lutz, aka Director X, who, by the way, on some of his music videos was Producer X. <laughs> like, is he Husband X? Is he dipshit X? Like, what's going on? Don't know. But it's created by him, otherwise known by his alias Director X, and featuring a story by Orphan Black Story coordinator Chris Roberts. The eight episode near fi action drama is described by his host network, Canada's global television network, as a contemporary reimagining of Robin Hood, wherein Robin, with a Y, is a fearless young woman who is not just another superhero with abilities normal people don't have. She is a Gen Zer driven by the injustices of today who embraces the heroic, hopeful, and playful elements of the world's most recognizable folk hero. No, she doesn't. Just watch that first episode. Four minutes is all it takes, and you realize, oh, they seem to be the villains. It is ridiculous. And look at the cast. 
the entire cast is black except two white people spot who the villains are in this i'll give you a clue they're a little bit paler in complexion and yet he is complaining and saying that we are making it all about race no you have made it about race by race swapping the character and characters in the story of robin hood reimagining or not modern day take or not that's what you did you made all the good guys black all the villains white and then you're turning around and telling us it's not about race of course it's about race and he's been going on his little meltdowns all over twitter or x which he, i'm surprised he's not trying to say elon musk uh, copyrighted his name or some crap but he's also trying to get on people's shows youtuber shows he reached out and was going to appear not on the show but behind the scenes to talk with as from hill versus babyface until he came out with his whole you are all racist crap and as simply went yeah no you have nothing to say that i want to hear he wants to get on the quartering here desperate he's reaching out to all these people he's desperate for the clout he's desperate to try and do anything to promote this disaster piece and the ratings are out that's right the ratings are out it aired in canada on global tv in 29th position episode 2 debuted at position 69 on that chart that's a 50 percent drop <laughs> but don't worry it's just because everyone is racist and the show isn't about race we're all just angry nerds what a moron but keep screaming scream as loud as you can director x because you just show what kind of idiot you are how boring you are if it's not about race and it wasn't about that stuff why did it have to be robin hood why couldn't you have created something original properly original and let's not go into the whole cultural appropriation that this is seen as he's an english folklore tale that you've stolen to make a canadian folklore tale in modern times that's right that would be deemed cultural appropriation you're stealing another cultural's stories and making them your own but don't go down that road don't start calling that out because you will get annihilated <laughs> oh what a fool what an idiot and as for the show what an absolute dumpster fire by the way no one cares like the reason there's no investors coming out and complaining about this is because investors didn't actually put money into this charities and the taxpayers money basically went in to funding this garbage that's right your hard-earned money there in canada that went to producing this absolute dog shit of a tv show known as robin with a y hood disaster good luck in getting the season two <laughs> Uh, and with that, I'll leave it there for this one. So cheers, I'll catch you in the next one.